Hello, iJailbreak Nation. This is Jaden from iJailbreak.com, and today we will be covering the Jellylock beta Cydia tweak. You could previously beta test Jellylock on a private repository, but looks like its developers are looking to reach a broader audience to polish the tweak. In its current state, Jellylock actually works extremely well. For those who haven't heard of the tweak, as you can see here, it gives your iPhone or iPod Touch the Android Jelly Bean lock screen. You simply tap the circular lock icon and drag it to the unlock icon to unlock your device, or of course drag it to one of the shortcuts positioned around the circle. There can be up to 6 applications placed around the circle which are configured in the settings app, as you can see here. From the main settings panel for Jelly Lock, there's actually quite a few options. There's a kill switch, the ability to disable or enable the lock label, and turn the badges functionality on or off for notifications. There's an option to enable or disable the hidden assistant feature that allows you to bring up either Siri or Google Now by placing your finger just below the lock icon and dragging the invisible circle to the Siri position like you can see demoed here. You can also adjust the appearance which is great for matching themes or just making your lock screen unique to stand out for the crowd. Let's quickly change the appearance of Jelly Lock. We will choose a new color for the circle, a new color for the label, and then we can adjust the size and position of the circle. When you slide over to the left on this first slider, you are making the circle smaller, and when you swipe to the right, you are making it larger. On the slider beneath, you can slide it to the right and the circle will appear higher on the lock screen, and when you slide to the left, it will appear lower, slightly offset. Underneath, you can swap the positions of the default unlock and camera shortcut, and then play around with the sizing of both the main unlock circle and unlock icon. The last option is the ability to play with the opacity of the user interface of Jelly Lock. Let's take a look what our modifications now look like. Pretty neat, huh? The only other options we can play around with is vibration, which is self-explanatory, and some advanced options such as replacing the lock screen icon and redefining the camera shortcut, which is useful if you use Camera Plus, for example, over the stock camera app. Then you can of course customize all the shortcuts shown on the lock screen. All in all, Jelly Lock is a great lock screen replacement for those who like Android Jelly Bean's lock screen. It doesn't feel as native as tweaks like Atom, but it does have more customization options. You can find Jelly Lock Beta in the Mama I repo for free. The full version will likely be a premium tweak, so you better grab it while you can. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe for more great content and let me know what you think of the tweak in the comments section below. This has been Jaden with iGLBreak.com and for more city tweak reviews and tech news be sure to check out the site.